Hello YouTube, this is Bowtide Media, and today I am excited. I'm wearing my Monster Cat shirt, one of my very, very many Monster Cat apparel things that I've owned, because we have a Grant release. I am so excited for new Grant. Oh, I just, I love him so much. Um, by the way, just top five favorite artists of all time. You got Daft Punk, you got Eden, Grant, Tristam, Mr. Fiji Ouija. So when Tristam and Grant are releasing songs back to back, just... Oh, I'm just loving this as of late. So we're going to get into it. Fix it. It is Grant and Run. Grant talked about on socials how he has a lot of, uh, I don't know, mental stuff going on uh, when it comes to his life right now and how it involves his project, his Grant project. Um, and this is the first time he's kind of talked about it online. And so this song, I think, is a huge um, product of that feeling and that uh, I don't know, pressure, a lot of stuff, and a lot of emotions that he was feeling. Um, so let's get into it. I am super excited. If I had to guess, I'd say this is probably going to be something closer to Where Will We Go, just based off of what he had said about the track previously. But I just want to listen to it. So here we go. Uh, Grant and Run, Fix It. Really diving into the feelings. No holding back. Ooh. I love it. Oh, this is fun. Ooh, a little guitar in there? Oh my. Yo, so much is happening. <laughs> what? Oh my gosh. that high. Gosh, I love this! Oh, please. It's not gonna do a third drop, but... Oh... Okay! Wow. That was... <laughs> that was so awesome! I love that so much! Holy man, I am never disappointed by Grant. I don't think ever in my life have I been disappointed by a, a Grant track. I think the lowest I've ever scored any individual song of his is an 8 out of 10. And that would have been his early stuff. I think like Cloud 9 would have maybe been an 8 or something like that. I think Reach was a 10, I think. But holy crap, that thing was just killer! Um... The, the drops, I, I, I couldn't tell if they were uh, copy-paste or not, but they, they sounded decent enough different. They, it felt different, at least, even if it wasn't. Um, man, that first hit of that first drop, like, that just came out of nowhere and blindsided me. And then, like, the, like, four seconds where the, not even, like, like 
two beats where that guitar just comes in and just slams it home for like two seconds. Holy crap. That was, that was so nice. I big fan of that song. Um, personally, my favorite Grant stuff is the stuff that is um, more emotionally driven. And this is one of those kind of similar tracks. Um, but in that, I mean kind of the uh, Constellations and Wishes are my top two favorite. Constellations is actually probably my favorite song of all time. Um, it just has so, it just tells a great story from front to end and has some of my favorite drop sections of all time. And oh, I just, I love that track so much. Um, especially Wishes too. it has the big builds to it. So while the song didn't have all the big builds uh, in the sections, like it didn't kind of um, have that long intro as like either Constellations or Wishes did, especially Wishes, um, it's still a great track. It's like, uh, I mean, Contagious that had run before. It feels a lot like Contagious just had with some emotional undertones, um, some really nice, uh, yeah, just emotional undertones to the whole track. Man, that drop just has so much in it. It has some wide girth uh, in just what is happening. Holy crap. Um, wow, that song is so fun. Um, easily a 10 out of 10 track for me. I can figure that out with Grant pretty much right away. Um, Oh man, I can't get over how much I enjoyed that track. Um, this is pro this is easily out of all the re reaction first listens I've done. This is easily the one I'm the most pleased with immediately right off the bat. Um, oh man, I just love Grant so much. Um, let me give another listen and then I'll uh, come back with some <laughs> hopefully some more analyzed thoughts. Okay, the one thing I need to <laughs> go back and correct. I said the part about the guitar. It's obviously not a guitar. It's a bass. I'm yeah, whatever. Um, I so I didn't listen to it by knowing the track length right away, but I realize now that it's it's actually really short. It's only two minutes and fifty one seconds. Um, that's why I was kind of hoping that little end part was gonna have a third extended drop. Um, but I mean. Uh, that's okay. Uh, I still love the track. And, oh, man, Run killed it. Um, the Especially the middle part where it's the, I wish I, I, I can't do it. Um, tons of energy. Brings so much to the track. Ah, uh, man. Man, Grant just doesn't disappoint. Like, why don't you just disappoint sometimes? So that I'm not always super eager to listen to what you're going to hear. I don't know, that's stupid to say. Um... Oh man, okay. I'm I need to go listen to this song some more myself. Uh let me know what you guys think of this track. Uh where does it rank in terms of other Grant songs? Um again, it's not my favorite right away. It's not a constellation, it's not a wishes. Um but whoo, this is this is something good. This is something special. But uh I've been Bowtied Media. I will see you guys in another video.